Just checking out this final day. Working on this pen. It's 2013. Uh, September 2nd, Labor Day. Uh, took about two weeks, I would say. Working, doing the conducive hours of the day because it's getting really, really hot up in the day. Really, 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 really hot. But uh, got some fine tuning to do. As you can see, we got some tightening up to do. But uh, came up with that little innovation right there. That was pretty good idea about how I can tie it. I've seen a lot of people tie it with wire, but those are hog rings that I purchased from the local feed and seed store. Uh, as you can see right here, I have a pond in mind, so I don't have to worry about watering rabbits. They can actually come in um, and get water on their own. We dug this thing out about two years ago, and it's deep enough so it holds water year-round because it's been really, really hot. If it was going to dry out, it would have done it by now. Uh, those are my corner anchors. I got to contribute that to a good friend of mine. Can't call his name. Don't want to get him in trouble. But that's some good stuff he did for me. Uh, like I said, I got to work on these corners. Get them tight. But this is actually... You can see all the way back up there to that trailer. This is the area. It's actually a one acre area. Um, 70 by 70 by actually 61 on one side. So a few feet shy of an acre. But this is the area we got to really go ahead and tighten up today. But pretty much it's a done deal. Uh, we are Right here, I got where we connect the wire together. Put a beam in between it and use those little ties and just overlap it and keep it going. Got a tension wire on the bottom. That's so predators won't be able to come in here because they're going to try, try to dig in. There's another spot we had to add on right there in that little section. But I have a foot overhanging on the bottom. And it's a five foot high fence. Really came together real nice. Very pleased with it. I just made a whole complete circle on this fence. Once I get up here, I'll show you my uh, gate area. And that will be a complete walk around this fence, which I'm very proud of. And we'll be training some nice beagles here. I'm um, probably going to stock it initially with four rabbits. A little acre like that, four is enough. And you really don't want to overdo it. Don't want the dog to be jumping rabbits as he's running another one. Tracks will be overlapping. So, another corner. And last but not least, this is the gate area gotta do a little work on it just put it up today like I said pretty much 95% through September 2nd 2013